locate the neck of the gown and apply a pincer grip with the thumb and forefinger to each side, being careful not to touch the outside of the gown. With the remaining fingers, pick up the folded gown and move away from the trolley. While retaining the pincer grip at the neck of the gown, allow it to unfold. Do not shake the gown, as this causes turbulence resulting in debris rising from the floor which can contaminate the hands or the front of the gown. Moving your hands and arms outwards, locate the sleeves and move your hands and arms into them. Be aware of your surroundings during this procedure. An assistant will loosely tie your gown at the back, being careful not to touch the front of your gown. At no time should you allow your hands to exit the cuffed end of the sleeve. Now, fold a portion of the cuffs inwards to allow you to perform the closed gloving method. Gloving Request your preferred glove size and type, being aware that some specialties, for example, use ultra-sensitive gloves. In orthopaedics, you will probably be required to double glove. Please note you should use gloves half a size larger than your normal size and don them first. Open the sterile packet on the sterile field and create a fold along the bottom edge to stop the pack folding in on itself. As demonstrated here, using the enclosed left hand, turn the glove onto the upward facing right hand. Open the cuff of the glove with the left hand and slide the fingertips of the right hand into the cuff. Take the double layer of glove on top of the right hand and pull this over the back of the right fist and thumb. Take the ribbed single edge of the glove and pull this down over the wrist. Pull the sleeve of the gown down from front and back of the gloved hand allowing the fingers to just emerge. Take hold of the fingertips of the glove and stretch them out to exactly align the fingers and thumb of the hand. Holding the sleeve and the gown at the wrist, pull downwards until the glove is in the correct position. Now repeat the procedure for the left hand. Finally, to secure the gown, an assistant will adjust any loose ties at the back. The waist ties vary in position, but generally you should hold the tie that you can see is attached at the side. Straighten the piece of card prior to handing this, with its tie firmly attached, to an assistant. Turn around slowly and grasp the tie prior to pulling it from the card. It is important to develop an awareness of theatre environment. Care needs to be taken when moving in the locality of sterile trolleys and other members of the gowned theatre team. 
when passing, either personnel or items, always face those that are sterile with your back towards the unsterile, thus avoiding potential. Changing a glove during the procedure. If you need to change a glove during a procedure, an unscrubbed assistant wearing unsterile gloves should take hold of your glove and the underlying gown at the wrist, ensuring they do not touch the sleeve directly. As you move your hand backward into the sleeve, the assistant should ease the glove forward and remove it. This will leave you with your hand in the correct position to re-glove using the closed method.